Today's Ocean Quickie is about a house. Not just any house, but this one here. A house which has glass panels filled with algae on the southwest and southeast facade in order to produce energy for the house and its inhabitants. Despite the fact that the algae used are freshwater algae of the genus Hematococcus, I think a bioreactor house using algae is closely enough linked to oceans in order to be covered here by emotion. Now let's have a look how this house works. In the center of everything are the algae-filled glass panels and the sun, which provides energy so that the algae can make photosynthesis. Due to the photosynthesis, they multiply and produce biomass, which is harvested. The biomass is fed into a biomass reactor in order to produce biogas. The biogas, in turn, is burned in a fuel cell in order to produce electrical energy, which provides electricity to the house. When something burns, heat is developed, which feeds into the power station of the algae house. And CO2 is released, and this carbon dioxide is used to feed the algae in the glass panels. The power station saves and distributes heat for heating and warm water of the house. If there is surplus energy, it will be fed into community heating, from where also heat is taken in case required. And then additionally, the algae also absorb solar power, solar energy, and thus heat up and feed into the power station. The algae have to be permanently fed with carbon dioxide and culture medium and ventilated and mixed with pressurized air. This is done via the support tubes at the bottom of the panels. Via these tubes also the heat exchange and the harvesting of algae is happening. The algae filled glass panels can be moved in order to give shade to the balconies or windows. The density of algae within the solution is permanently monitored and altered according to the forecasted sun intensity. So if there is only little sun, the density will be lower in order to allow for perfect photosynthesis rates in low light situations. When the sun intensity is higher, the solution will be much thicker also in order to optimize the photosynthesis. Currently, this house, which was opened last month, is the only algae bioreactor house in the world. It is standing in Hamburg, where it was built in the context of the International Building Exhibition Internationale Bauausstellung. Mm -hmm.